Hey, how's it going? This is Ro here from Direct Quality Auto Glass. We are working on a 2023 Ram. I want you guys to check out this part number. It's going to be the domestic back 13009. We ended up getting this one, I believe, from Import Glass Corp. Uh, this is also the factory part number if you guys want to take a look at that. Pause the video if you need to. But going back to this, this is a very, very simple back glass. This is not like your traditional Toyota Tacoma where you could do everything right here or some of your other like the Ford F-150s. Um, this is of course a power slider. Very simple glass. The only thing is it does take uh, certain tools, okay? So if you look at this Torx design, this design right here, uh, this right here, this socket is an E12. We got this kit from Mako Tools, as you guys can see. You'll also be using this a lot on like on European vehicles. Um, the other tool that we need is a five millimeter socket. As you guys can tell, it's a super small skinny one. Once you remove the seats, you remove the seats of course with the E12. Take off the seats, fold them down. You don't have to pull them out, okay? This one right here, as you guys can see, I only moved it out of the way a little bit because you don't need to pull, fully take it out. That way you're able to tuck it back in through the side panels, okay? As you can see, it has, um, it has, of course, like the, the wire for, for this side, and then you can also see the wire for that side. Um, if you can see, there's a vice grip right there. That way, I put it there so that way the whole cable, of course, doesn't come off, okay? The other thing, too, if you're at a shop, for example, with us, we have compressed air. Um, I already cleaned it up, but what I do, I'll blow out all the glass there. If you are in a mobile service situation, make sure you're vacuuming it. Um, if you look right here to the right, I have a bunch of lights right here. Those are some of the lights that we're using, of course, um, for, for this uh, uh, replacement. So we're going to go ahead and grab the glass. As soon as you, of course, take this one off, this is where the five millimeter screws at. You take it off, you pull it out, and then you just move it to the side. On the very top, it also has, um, it has this piece. It has like double-sided tape on it. Leave it like that, okay? You want to leave it like that? Don't clean it off. Don't try to add a new one. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and just add a little bit of uh, water or glass cleaner. Just spray it on there. And I'm going to leave it on there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to let it air dry. Once it air dries, it becomes sticky again, okay? So you grab the glass. Remember, you see? You do this. You put it right here on the side. Move this forward back a little bit. You want to get the front, okay? Get the front, bring this down. As you can see, it dropped all the way. Right here on the side, it has a groove, right here. You won't be able to see it from the, from the camera view. But what you do, once you get it in there, you just slide it. There you go, I just like to wiggle it a little bit so that way it stays back in the center. As you guys can see, it's fully on there. Now what I'm going to do, I'm gonna go ahead and grab this. I'm going to go ahead and put the, of course, uh, the connector in here. Once I put the connector, then I'm going to go ahead and pull it this way. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and scoot this a little bit to the right. I'm going to go ahead and get this guy in here and I'll go ahead and release it and then I'll test it and that'll be pretty much it. From here is very simple. You put this back on, you put the clips back on, um, or of course, sorry, tuck it first, put the clips back on, lift up the seat. The seat, of course, goes hooked on. And once it gets hooked on, then it has um, the the 15 millimeter socket in the back, and it has the what did I say it was? I think it's the 12. I believe I said it was the 12. Yeah, the B12 for the bolts in the front. Here I have everything organized. As you guys can see, the 15, and of course the B12. Yeah, that was correct. Yeah, uh, E12. Sorry, E12. So I hope that this video is somewhat useful to somebody. If you guys like this video, go ahead and like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what kind of content you guys want to see. I always like making new